May 13, 2018. This dream starts with chaos in Pakistan, and there is a lot of fear among the people. Resources and funds of Pakistan are also finished. Army is unable to fight, and there are speculations whether this country will survive or not. Using this chaotic situation to its advantage, India opens up various fronts against Pakistan and starts killing the people in different areas in large numbers. The number of Pakistani troops is small, and they keep moving along the borders, but they can't defend the whole border efficiently. Every Pakistani is sad over the appalling condition of Pakistan. Then India opens up another aggressive front at a place, and the army of Pakistan is mobilized to tackle the situation. I only see two helicopters in the entire arsenal of Pakistan's army. Upon seeing this, I said to myself that this situation is the interpretation of a previous dream of mine where I see that ammunition of Pakistan's army is finished and they only have two helicopters left. But there is some ammunition with the army chief and there is a big tank type machine on the other side which is not getting destroyed. At this occasion, people start complaining to the army chief that if the army chief had done planning according to Qasim's dreams before, then we wouldn't have faced these problems. Then the people start saying to me that, Qasim, please do something and take us out of this misery. Looking at those bad circumstances, I said that, now it is too late. How can I fix all this mess? And I ignore what the people said to me. People became very hopeless that there is no hope of getting out of this miserable condition. Then India starts a big operation at some place and start killing the Pakistani people. On this the president of the USA says to India that stop these killings. You have only been ordered to control Pakistan and not the killings. After this India aborts this big operation. I became very sad on seeing all this that we had to face this time of disgrace and people of Pakistan also became very grieved. Once again people turned towards me and try and push me to do something. Army chief also says that Qasim, we were wrong, we should have listened to you under any circumstance and we should have made plans to save Pakistan. We have made a mistake and we are regretful for that. Please do something and help us out. I said that without the help and mercy of Allah, I will not be able to do anything. At this point, I get a strong feeling that whatever I will say, Allah will make that happen by His mercy. Then I invoke Allah's name and say to myself that they haven't even seen the army of Allah yet. Then I call out and a lot of fighter jets and other war machines and tanks come out of the earth. And India got absolutely gobsmacked upon seeing that arsenal. Then I said that by the help of Allah, now we will end all kinds of darkness and there will be no one to stop us.